Boy, y'all really liked that first edition Starbomb album thing, didn't you? We uh, made a bunch of ads for it and didn't get to put them up because they sold out so fast. Yeah, so due to very overwhelming demand, uh, we are going to be taking pre-orders for a second release of it. Um, it won't be the same as the first release, so everybody who got that first set is a very exclusive thing, but it's still gonna be all three albums on vinyl, remixed, remastered. You're gonna get some stickers, you're gonna get a poster, signed card from us. Go pre-order it and, you know, hopefully we'll get them to you as soon as we can. Yeah. Last time on Game Grabs! So that probably tipped over the lighter to reach the curtain. It was like a Rube Goldberg contraption. Yeah. Which is definitely how I want to go. Oh, for sure. Yeah. And I want them to play the, the powerhouse music. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Yeah. Or maybe like a Danny Elfman song, like the one from Pee Wee's Big Adventure. Yeah, watch the egg roll down yeah. the thing and then land in the pan bum, and then... Bum, bum, bum. And you're like and hanging up and you're like, no! Nah. Yeah, and then a spear just gets shot through my heart. Zoom! <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Breakfast! <laughs> 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 <It's eggs>! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It is a misunderstanding. I am not the killer. Jesus, ish, you son of a bitch. Holy crap. <laughs> Damn, Sonia. Sonia. <laughs> oh, fucking Christ. <laughs> Darkness. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I'm, I was panicking. You Nelxat on face go face! Harley's a chump! I'm not so grump! And we're the game grumps! That's back, we're back. Alright! Don gun bun bun. Hello. What is this, year 17? It feels like it. That we're doing this? <laughs> well, I mean, because these are airing only on the weekends now, so. Yeah, yeah. This is gonna be like three years from now. No, no question. Uh my name is Aaron. Uh, and I'm Dan. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We're going inside the door now. Okay, let's do it. So you have opened the door, you can freely investigate now. This isn't my first time seeing that, but why does the door open with a spell like that? Perhaps. Oh, maybe the cottage key is computerized. Hey, hey. Maybe the cottage key is computerized. Mmm, <laughs> cottage keys. <laughs> More importantly, <laughs> let's go inside now that maybe I'll dip my finger in it. Cottage key. Mmm, <laughs> cottage key. Let's go inside now that the door is open! Yeah, you're right. It's an Albany expression. I see. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh! So Nagito is living here. Looks very him. <laughs> what was he, he really made it his own. <laughs> what was he thinking inside this room? How, what was he feeling as he spent his days in here? I can't even imagine. And it's not like I'll find out because he's fucking dead. Wanting to see absolute hope, becoming despair so he could act as a stepping stone for the rest of us. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> no matter how much I think about it, I just don't understand him at all. I don't even know if he truly blew. Oh shit, a treasure chest. <laughs> he was especially weird these past few days. What changed him? Was it the spear? Maybe the clue to that might be hidden here as well. Ah, I just wanted to kiss him! <laughs> I mean, a treasure chest. A fancy looking treasure box covered in sparkling pink lights is totally standing out. Mon I don't know why I didn't mention it before I walked in. Monokuma's in the tub. Oh my god. Yeah, go grab that token. I'm getting hot and bothered in here. Uh, could this be? Can you let me know if you found my treasure? It's a magnificent treasure box covered in sparkling pink lights. All right, then. It's a magnificent treasure box covered in special <laughs> pink light. Chuck, you know about this? Yep. It's really cute. Oh, she was just reacting. This looks like Monomi's stolen treasure box. If this is here, that means the thief Monomi was talking about was Nagito. Who would have guessed? Well, but why would Nagito steal this? In order to find out, we must revive Nagito. <laughs> it might be good to see what's inside. Is it going to be okay? It looks a little dangerous. How does it look dangerous? It might be, but this could be some kind of clue, you know? If this wasn't important, Nikita wouldn't have stolen it from Nomi in the first place. Or maybe he would, and he's just fucking insane. Hmm. They turned back <laughs> towards the treasure box and cautiously opened the lid. Inside, there was a notebook. This is it? <laughs> Why is a notebook inside this treasure box like it's something important? He took the notebook out of the treasure box and began leafing through it. It contained sloppy drawings as if they were drawn by children. 
and entries that looked like chicken scratch. So ugly, fuck! <laughs> Day one, I was able to talk to everyone for the first time today. Monokuma showed up and turned things turned bad. Day two, Byaki is the leader. A lot of things happened today, so everyone's tired. What is this, a diary? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Looks like it. Did Minomi write this? Probably. These pictures and entries totally suit her. There's also these little shit marks on there. <laughs> what? Right, please. So he's, so he's shit in her diaper. <laughs> I kept flipping through the pages. Day three, day four, day five. How many days are there? <laughs> page after page of poorly written entries continued on in the notebook. God, she's stupid. Why are they all so mean to her? All she does so is like mean. try to help them. So mean. I don't really understand, but it looks like there aren't any clues here. And right when I was about to give up, my hand suddenly stopped on an entry titled Day 16. It was the 16th day. <laughs> We've been in the fun house for three days. Everyone's hungry and on edge. Ajibe tried to go to the final dead room today. He's probably panicking because no one believes him. Huh? huh? Hey, hey. Ajibe, did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. Stop. Hey, stop! Don't look at my notebook! Whoa! Oh. From out of nowhere, a anomaly suddenly appeared and took the notebook out of my hand. I won't you. Phew! I did ask you to look for my treasure pucks, but I never said you were allowed to peek inside. Wait, did she say... You? But we didn't do that. Right. That's why it's strange. No, that is weird. Okay. Jeez, that was close. If I'd come in later, he would have seen this in, inside the notebook. Unfortunately, you were a little too late. He saw inside the notebook. He saw day 16. <laughs> oh, well, but if this notebook is here, then Nikita was the thief. No. Betrayal! I was betrayed by my beloved student. Hey, that notebook, it's pretty much your diary, right? Diarrhea? Um... <laughs> That's Spanish. Not for right diary. now. <laughs> <laughs> it seems that way. That's right. This is my important diary where all my maiden secrets are written. I'm in Italian. <laughs> That's fine. Hey, hey, you're a liar. Oh, wow, well, wow. Well, you always show up out of nowhere. My name is no good to lie, you know. Lie? <laughs> There's no way you wrote in that notebook. After all, Minobi can't even write! Huh? Well, what are you saying? Jeez, I can write letters easily. I, I can finally write the letter B. That's wrong. No, you can't, because you have no fingers on your hands. Yeah. hey yo! <laughs> See? Bullseye. I know, because I'm the same way, too. <laughs> huh? Are you mad? Are you angry that I exposed a weakling like you? Hey, hey. So that's what this is about. <laughs> Oh it's like, God. this is the turn right here. Yeah. <laughs> she goes super sane. This is what it's all about. You just been trying to make fun of me and I can't write. You've been trying to get all these kids to kill each other just so they find out that I can't write. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're seriously trying to crush me. What are you hmm? saying? What are you saying? There's no way a big brother would ever crush his little sister. It looks like the time to settle things between us is getting closer every second. Just do it. Hey, I don't know why you're getting so serious, but is what Monokuma said true? Huh? He said he didn't write in that notebook, is that true? <laughs> <laughs> if so, who wrote in it? Oh, um, uh, well, you know, it's a, uh, how should I put it? Bye -bye. Excuse me! Hold on! Damn it, she totally ran away again. Same pattern as usual, it looks like it's a waste of time trying to get answers from her. But still, I really wanted to ask her about that notebook. Well, actually, it might be better that I didn't ask her. Or why? Why? Why <laughs> <laughs> oh, <I> then? <laughs> uh, but oh, why though? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Why? Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, oh, why though? <laughs> I have to use two hands for this. <laughs> it's Monokuma. Mmm. <laughs> Oh. It took me out of my bath. I was having a lot of fun there. It was really nice. What do you want, Shiaki? Our time for investigating is winding down. The bookshelf might take some time to investigate, so we should try examining some other areas first. Oh, okay. Right, there's other stuff to look at. <laughs> Basic layout's just like my cottage. There's nothing about this window that really catches me eye. Okay. <laughs> Captain. Long John Silver. <laughs> <laughs> Arr, there's nothing about this window that really catches me eye. 
<laughs> oh, I don't have a fridge. Yeah, this is the fridge of a landlubber. Huh? Nice! My cottage doesn't even have a refrigerator. I wonder where he got it from. <laughs> the Guido probably supplied it himself. Ooh, speaking of fridge, can someone please put my sandwich in the fridge? <laughs> It's sitting outside the building. <laughs> Why would he go to the trouble of putting a refrigerator Thank in Thank you. Does he really enjoy cold drinks? As I talked with Chiaki, I opened the refrigerator out of curiosity. Monokuma special poison for, for poison poisoning you use only. <laughs> That's awesome. Ugh, but there really isn't much inside. Oh man. Just a jar of poison. That just took me back to the to the poisoning from the first Danganronpa. Where, oh, yeah. where there was the some, something was all over the floor, and we had, were matching footprints and stuff, and... I don't remember that at all. Oh, jeez. I remember there being poison in a shelf or something. Sweet memories. Okay. The only thing inside the refrigerator was a brown bottle. Hmm. Hmm, for someone who likes cold drinks, it doesn't look like he stocks very much. You're the one who said he likes cold drinks. <laughs> <laughs> but that bottle clearly isn't a drink, right? Really? Looks like some kind of dietary supplement to me. Protein powder, maybe? Oh, it's poison! Yeah. I took the brown bottle out of the fridge and started reading the label. Oh, maybe it's protein poison. <laughs> Exclusively made for poisoning someone to death? That's not what it says. <laughs> hey, hey, this is... Yeah, it looks like it's poison. Poison? Yeah, it says it on the label. Looks like there's a warning label on the back. Let's examine it in a little more detail. I love Brett Michaels. <laughs> but be careful with that bottle! Don't drop it! Rock of Love is a great show! <laughs> Did you ever listen to Unskinny Bop? <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. If you worry like that, I'm gonna get nervous. Nervous! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> if I turn the bottle round here! <laughs> <laughs> I grabbed the bottle with my trembling hand and began reading the warning label on the back of the bottle. Poison made specifically for killing someone! Exclamation mark! It's Monokuma's special poison! Oh man, if they drink that, they're gonna have a long December! <laughs> but there's reason to believe maybe this year will be better than the last. No, it won't, because you'll be dead. <laughs> I, I just walked in here like, what the hell is happening? This enchanted liquid... Enchanted liquid is highly potent and takes yeah. effect immediately. Wow, please, it's magical. Please handle with care. Though its volatility is low, this liquid is very dangerous when vaporized. In a gaseous state, it is heavier than air. It breaks down in minutes and is susceptible to hydrolyz hydrolysis. <laughs> is it possible for you to poison someone? To so it is possible for you to someone poison someone to death without any complications. <laughs> Keep this liquid secure. As complicated as it is to read, it's simple to use. <laughs> Keep this liquid secure by storing it in a cold place in a glass or plastic container away from sunlight. <laughs> oh boy. This sure doesn't look like a chemical made solely for poisoning someone to death. This refrigerator must be here to keep the poison secure. Or cold. But where did Nagito get something like this? Well, that question would apply to the bomb he used at the hotel too. Apply to the bomb? See? Yes, they're taking applications right now. <laughs> this should be a reason Nagito was able to obtain <laughs> such dangerous items. The, the bomb is the hottest new club in town. <laughs> you need to apply to get in. The dancing is explosive. <laughs> <laughs> they say, when you leave, you go out with a bang. <laughs> <laughs> the octagon inside the fun house is poison. He must have brought it with him from there too, right? Perhaps. He was probably hiding them somewhere on his body during the last class trial. Hot? He was hiding a bomb and a poison during the class trial? <sighs> Jeez, how dangerous. What would he have done if he accidentally tripped and broke the bottle? Died. Or exploded the bomb! <laughs> Just thinking about it scares me. Also, he already blew up the bomb he took with him at the lobby, so that's accounted for. But what about this poison? That, wait, you're ba you're flipping their lines now. Oh, sorry. Huh? <laughs> See? It looks like the bottle is less than half empty. Was it like this from the beginning? Or did he drink it? <laughs> did the key to use it? If so, where did he use it? Why? How? And what did he look like? <laughs> I wonder, is there still a trap somewhere that hasn't been sprung yet? Another trap. <laughs> For example, maybe he was making some kind of trap using this poison before he died. If that actually exists, it'd be real bad. It could potentially kill everyone on this island. Why do you say that? <laughs> everyone on the island? <laughs> the hell? Well, at this point, it's only six people. Nagito, are you still trying to make us suffer? Are you still- ARE YOU STILL TRYING TO MAKE US SUFFER EVEN AFTER YOU DIED? Dick. <laughs> what an asshole. 
Monokuma special poison for special boys <laughs> who always follow the rules. There's a lot of books arranged here. Did Nagito bring these from the library? In addition to books, there's a bunch of random crap stuffed onto the shelves, like other books. Huh. Might take a lot of time for us to thoroughly go through that stuff. Looking for candy in the books. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they, they like cut out a little hole in the book, put candy in. <laughs> <laughs> you probably had some. <laughs> just give me a couple hours. <laughs> Let's just leave it for later. I'll read my way through all of them <laughs> to get to that sweet candy. Yeah, I agree. Oh no, the count of Monte Cristo! <laughs> That's a thousand pages! <laughs> also, a pretty big book to hide a lot of candy in. <laughs> it's a bed that comes with the cottages. Looks like the one in my room, but... Hey, hey. It's Nikitos. Maybe there's something hidden under his bed. It's the usual place for hiding things. Yeah, like porn? <gasps> Yeah, I well, mean, uh... <laughs> <laughs> well, we should just still check just in case there's porn. With no exceptions and without thinking, I peeked under the bed and... Porn. There's something here. It's a plastic bag from the supermarket. It looks like there's something inside. Uh, what is this?! It looks like a gas mask and rubber gloves. It's like a photo of them too, so... <laughs> yeah, it's, it's weird. Kind of, it's kind of taking me out of it a little bit. <laughs> These look like the real deal! It's sincerely. Like from a like from an extreme reality. Yeah. Did he get these from the military base? Or did he get them from real life? A mask and rubber gloves. He was hiding these under his bed. What did Nikito use his stuff for? Why did he hide this shit? Nobody comes in his room. Mask and gloves. Hajime. Hajime, was there anything else under the bed? Hmm. Like you and me? Uh <laughs> under the bed? Yeah. You know, it's a little intimate down there. <laughs> I peeked under the bed once again and started looking around the area where I found the supermarket bag and... Oh, there's a small piece of paper on the floor. It says, fuck you. It says, don't touch the bag. <laughs> <laughs> a piece of paper made of blue aluminum? Well, that's not really paper then, is it? <laughs> <laughs> a thin round piece of aluminum, huh? Must be paper. <laughs> it's similar to those seals that go over jars of unopened mayonnaise. I get what you're saying. But why mayonnaise? <laughs> yeah, specifically. Is that like Gatorade or like a protein Yogurt shake? Yogurt. Or... What does that mean? This is just a piece of trash? Wait. Mm, who knows? Might be too soon to decide that. You'll trade for blue. Alright, bye. Piece oh my of God. blue what paper. There's still stuff to investigate here. I looked at everything. Fridge, TVs, cameras. Did you look at the bookshelf? Oh. This is not the shower room. Oh. Since it's structured just like my room, the shower room is over here. But he got a better shower than I did, fuck! Looks like there aren't any clues here. He's got a giant piece of paper to crap in! <laughs> that- that it? I mean, I guess I'll look at the TV. What are those monitors? Just contacts over the radio and use actual streams. You enjoy blah 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 blah. Pissing me off! I mean, I just gotta talk to her again. Our time for investigating is winded- oh, for fuck's sake. Maybe the bookshelf again? Yeah, I think so. A lot of books. Genres of type are so random, I can't make any sense out of them whatsoever! Well, they say a shelf is a mirror that reflects the person's heart. Do they now? <laughs> Who says that? <laughs> I definitely don't know much about Nikito just by looking at this. He likes horse... <laughs> jars... <laughs> so what should we do? It would be really difficult to look through all these piles. That doesn't mean we should ignore it, though. Yep. I'll leave it to you then, Hajime. And if you find any candy, especially Jolly Ranchers, <laughs> let me know. Okay. Wait, what? Um, Better if a boy goes through another boy's things. You know, there might be private stuff there that only a boy would not be embarrassed by. I don't know. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but like, you know. <laughs> well, that might be true, but. So I'll leave this shelf to you. I'm just going to go over here. Okay. <laughs> Stare at the wall. I think I just got persuaded to do this without realizing it. I sighed and walked towards the shelf. Jar. Jar. <laughs> one by one, I started removing the various books and items and examining each one. And even as I examined them carefully, they were still a bunch of random books and items. There's no way there are any clues here. <gasps> a clue! <laughs> <laughs> Remember me, how cute I was? <laughs> <laughs> well, that file wasn't the only one I received from Monokuma. He would have been a likable guy if he wasn't crazy and weird and evil. Uh, you alright? 
Yeah, you could say that about literally any character that was ever weird and crazy and evil. I suppose you're right. This is another one. That seal. Indeed, it's the school badge of Hope's Peak Academy. Does that have information about our stolen memories? Unfortunately, I couldn't find any clues about that. Oh, I'll never get to see you again, Hand. This file doesn't contain our information, just Hajime's information. Nagito said this only contained information about me, but is that really true? If I look at this, it should be obvious, right? And he said I was from the reserve department and had no talent whatsoever. That might be another one of his lies, too. I opened the file. I held it in my hand to confirm that. Instantly, I realized something was strange. If this really has only my information, then why? Is this file so thick? Am I that interesting? Oh, God, so thick. <laughs> as soon as I opened it, it was clear to me, just as I thought, Nikito had lied to me. Aside from my information, there was information about others. Kazu Ichi, Fuyu Haiko, Akane, <laughs> and Sonaya. <laughs> and everyone who died had pages of information about them too. The file contained information on all 16 of us. Only my information, my ass. Pfft, I shouldn't have been so stupid. I can't believe you make such a strange lie. So that means the rest of it might be a lie too? I turned the- Really? Like, it's the most unreliable guy ever. Yeah. I turned to the page containing my information and began reading through the content. The profile contained basic information such as my date of birth, my height and weight, so forth, penis size. But there was one thing that specifically caught my eye. Penis size. <laughs> <laughs> reserve Corps student. There was no denying it. It confirmed that I truly was a Reserve Corps student from the Reserve Department. Why is this the only thing that isn't a lie? Why am I the only one here who's from the Reserve Department? Why am I here with all the other Ultimates? Fuck. God, suck. Has he made it something happen? Did you remember you suck? <laughs> oh, well, I just found a strange file. Ah! Isn't that the special prize Nikita received when he cleared the final dead room? As I recall, your student profile should be in there. It's not just my profile. Profiles of everyone on the island are in here, too. GIVE ME THAT SHIT! <laughs> Nagino wasn't lying. He was lying. Nagino was lying. <laughs> <laughs> Crucial difference. <laughs> when you say everyone, do you mean everyone? Yeah, it's just basic information, but there should be profiles for all 16 of us. GIVE ME THAT! <laughs> Can I take a look at that file? Chiaki leaned against me and peered into the file. It was kinda hot. Oh. Hell yeah. <laughs> You're right. My profile is really in here. But unfortunately... There doesn't seem to be any details. Details? Details about our missing memories. Information about the time we spent at Hope's Peak Academy. Explanations so for how my eyebrows could be over my hair. <laughs> yeah. Why is it so fucking thick then? Hmm. If it's not written in there... Then it must be written out here. <laughs> <laughs> Check the air! Before we entered the Academy. <laughs> then it's impossible to obtain new clues from them. Yeah. Seems like it. Oh well, dead end. Throw it away. Ah, oh, hold on. Huh? Hmm? What happened? I just noticed it right now, but... My butt. <laughs> it rules. His name isn't in there, right? There's supposed to be 16 names worth of profiles, but his name is the only one missing, right? Hmm? Who are you talking about? I'm gonna hold out until five hours from now. Byakuya. Oh. I'm talking about Byakuya. Byakuya? Look carefully. No matter where I look, I don't see his name anywhere. <laughs> I haven't thought of him in forever. Yeah. No way! So what if a name isn't written in that file? Perhaps based on that, you think he might be the traitor? No, it's not just because his name isn't written in here. That's not the only reason I think he's suspicious. He just, like, was. He participated in the killing school life at Hope Speak Academy, right? For someone like him to be in a similar situation on this island, no matter what, it's definitely suspicious. It's true. I don't know, like, why or he, what. And he looked a little different. <laughs> <laughs> He's been working out. Well, well, it pains me to say this, but... What you're saying about the missing name and about the killing school life... Dad. It's totally wrong! There's a completely different reason! Different reason? You're getting all riled How should I put this? You guys have been getting all worked up about that Biakia for no reason. Which means the great mystery that you think around that Byakuya doesn't exist! What do you mean by that Byakuya? You're basing it on one person's cheap speculation. What do you mean?! What the heck?! You are, don't have to ask me that. Are there multiple Byakuya? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs>
There's a whole farm of Biakai! <laughs> You'd know the answer just by looking through those profiles, right? Huh? <laughs> He's like peeking up behind him. <laughs> hey, look. <laughs> <laughs> My eyes turn back to the file, then back to me, then back to the file. My files are now diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> one by one, I started flipping through the pages and confirming the names. Ultimate imposter. Suddenly I came across a page that was filled with question marks. Every section was filled with question marks. It could barely be considered a student profile. Wait On that page, I was only able to confirm one thing. Ultimate imposter. Oh my god. Was that not the real Byakuya? Yeah, I guess not. What? It's the ultimate imposter. No! What? It's not that ultimate. I mean, you know, it was a little different. He didn't look anything like him, but I mean, still, like, <laughs> that's fucking. You've got to be kidding me. So that's Byakuya's true identity. True identity. Yeah, it only makes sense to the people at oh home. Oh my god! Byakuya was never even in this game? What the fuck? Oh, Ali just stood up and smiled and nodded. Was that the one that you were talking about, Ali? Holy shit. Oh my shit. god. Different twist. This isn't even the twist. This isn't even What? About. Oh my god. Jeez. Oh, There's <laughs> That's crazy. But okay, this is the kind Here of Here I've stuff. been mourning mourning <laughs> mourning the loss. Sorry, could Byakuya. I'm, I'm putting mourning extra the loss of Byakuya. <laughs> I'm putting extra Y's and everything. That's fucking crazy. <laughs> So who got stabbed? Just uh, some dude? The ultimate, uh, the ultimate imposter. But see, this is what I don't get, alright? Okay. It didn't really have a whole lot of relevance to this case. It's just the fact that we know Byakuya. I mean, as far as we know now, but like... I don't know, the fact that they're telling us now makes me think that there might be more to be revealed. Oh, maybe. A uh, fake! So the Byakuya that we know and love, hey. or hate... Is still alive. Yeah, he was never even... A part of this. No, I guess not. That is bananas. Unless Byakuya is somebody else. Oh, Byakuya is soda. The wow. fact that his profile is filled with question marks isn't a mistake or an oversight. Surprisingly enough, that's the correct information regarding him. The ultimate imposter has no name, no permanent address, and even his age and gender is unknown. You know what? Honestly, it does also line up because this Byakuya was way nicer <laughs> than mm. the other one. Mm -hmm. Very helpful. Yeah. He's so he's like, not really I'll, the ultimate imposter. He's like, I'll protect you. <laughs> Basically, he doesn't exist. Because he doesn't exist, he's able to exist as anybody. That's his talent! Poo I'm not jealous of that at all! <laughs> that person wasn't really Byakuya Togami? Perhaps. Is that why he was so much fatter compared to when he was involved in the killing Whoa, school? Whoa, easy, like? Nanani. Dude! Nanami. Shiaki! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> his physique doesn't affect his ability to fool others at all. I mean, it was kind of like the first thing out the game. Yeah, we were like, kind of like, that, whoa. Biakia? Wow. All right. Real imposters are skilled like that. Then he was lying to us the whole time. Still. But he couldn't help it. What? What? Why couldn't he help it? Because oh. that was his talent. Huh? Well, having talent means you're also bound to that talent. Okay. <laughs> the moment you obtain talent, your way of life has already been chosen for you, I guess. You can't do- This is very Japanese right now. Yeah, I guess so. You can't do anything else except rely on that talent. Yeah, culture, culturally, we're- In America, it's more like, do what you want yeah. to do, as opposed to do what you're necessarily good at. Yeah. Regardless of whether you want that life or not. <laughs> In that sense, compared to the other Ultimates, your life might be a little a bit more liberating. What the hell?! Anyway. Um, anyway. I'm not happy that you guys fell for a scam that I had nothing to do with. So I'll tell you straight up, this revelation about Byakuya is exactly the truth. Then, what was he trying to say to me at that time? Remember? <laughs> That's you. You got Byakuya. I can't even remember what his voice was like. He was like, ah, oh, Byakuya. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. Distrusting others. Hmm, look at that ham. And being distrusted in turn, for a long time, my life has been a living hell. Huh. Hmm, based on the context, if I had to guess. No, maybe no. he was just complaining that he was cursed to wander the earth as nothing more than a fraud? I thought living hell was referring to the first game. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But if you guys had your school memories, you never would have been betrayed in the first place! Well, whose fucking fault is that? <laughs> oh, joke's on you! 
I mean, it'd be different if you were meeting him for the first time. But since you guys went to Hope Speak Academy, you should have known about the ultimate imposter already. So in the end... Oh boy. It all leads back to memory loss. Jeez, the future foundation sure is awful. There's no way you should ignore Monomi or the traitor. Who is it? Who's the traitor? Where is he? Who's the traitor? <laughs> <laughs> Just from looking at these 16 profiles, I still wouldn't know who's from the future fa- Oh, it's right here, it says. Okay. Uh, is there really someone like that? Of course. Well, obviously you wouldn't know. I made that file so you guys couldn't find out. Could it be? So it's just as I thought. You're the one who did it. Hey, um... The fact that there are 16 profiles in there is what's wrong. Uh... I mean, the traitor is a spy sent for the future foundation, not a student from Hope's Pig Academy. It, you made a fake profile for the traitor and included it in here? Oh, the one that looks like Chicken Scratch. This is the fake one. Correct. It wouldn't be fun if you figured out who the traitor was so easily, right? Hey, hey. Then we can't use this file to figure out who the traitor is. That was true for Nikito too, right? Hmm. Well, probably. True boy. <laughs> it's tripping with the- it's dripping with despair, isn't it? Get a tripping towel. Balls. <laughs> You wasted your precious time on something that isn't a clue. Are you sure? Was that a wise decision? Time's up, you know! Time's up, wait. Excuse me for a moment! Wait, no, hold on! Oh shit! Go, he got <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! What's going on? Chucky! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that chimed us now! <laughs> oh my lord. Now I'm here! What's <laughs> most important for living things? Well, personally, I think time is. Well, I mean, air. I'm gonna put air, so water, and food first. <laughs> Love. That's yeah. Why we gotta cherish time. There is nothing more wasteful. So. Thank you, bear, that forced us to kill each other. We will begin the last class. Last trial. class trial. Oh crap! Please gather at Monacuma Rock. Monacuma Rock. Oh, I guess chapter six is its own thing. Well, since this is the last class trial, you want to make out in here? <laughs> The last class trial, but there's- what about chapter six? <laughs> <laughs> he said that, right? He said last class trial? Kinda hard to say, you know, now that I'm yep. saying it. Yeah, I heard it too. He really did say it was the last class trial. Damn, it is hard to say. <laughs> what do you think? Should we believe him? Um... Monokuma seemed anxious about the Monokuma timer earlier, right? Two more days? And he said something about the killing school trip ending, right? Based on the time limit, this might definitely be the last one. Still. But I can't imagine that it's the real end. Huh? I think Monokuma's real plan might be just beyond that. His real plan? Is Monokuma still planning to make us do something? Like kiss? What could it be? <laughs> kiss? Maybe after putting <laughs> us all this, he's planning to kill the remaining survivals all at once or make us kiss? But still, it's also not a good idea to think about it too much, I think. You're right. I shouldn't think about us kissing. We should just kiss. <laughs> I think we should focus on the class trial that's waiting for us first. Yes, and then we think about kissing. A class trial for Nikito's murder. We're pretty screwed. I haven't collected my thoughts because we were so focused on this file. I still can't see who killed Nikito. But still. I'll just have to kiss everyone until I figure it out. <laughs> that was a very, very genuine kiss. I don't think you did it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have to wait. I'm not so sure about you. Yeah. Better go in for another kiss. <laughs> 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 That was a bit of a shallow kiss. <laughs> I'm feeling a little suspicious. <laughs> well, you don't have to worry so much. Huh? Right? I mean, we're not figuring this out alone. We're not fighting, we're not this, fighting alone. this alone, you know? You're we're right. I can't fight this feeling anymore. <laughs> You're right. You're absolutely right. We're not alone. Even if it's a mystery that can't be solved alone, as long as everyone cooperates and works together. Yeah, if we do that, things will turn out fine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, they're dead! <laughs> uh, I guess I gotta go to Monokuma Rock, eh? Yep, that's it. Monokuma Rock, you know? Yeah. <laughs> it's like rock, you know? Better believe it. Mm hmm Oh, fuck. Hello, my non-dead friends. Looks like everyone's here. An extra castable! Huh, is this it? Shouldn't there be more people? Damn it. Stop it, you're making me depressed! I'm here too! Remember me? You're making me depressed. <laughs> um. So, is it going to happen again? The cruel conflict where we must doubt our friends? 
<laughs> but once we're through this, we can go back, right? That Monokuma bastard said so, didn't he? He said this is the last class trial. Damn it. Well, we've been tricked every step of the way. There's no way I can believe that so easily. Of course not! Why can't you believe it? The guy who's making us do all this is the one saying it, you know? You know, right? That's why I'll definitely survive. Okay, can I say this out loud? Mm -hmm. Just in case my stupid theory is right. Please. So Allie has been very coy about what the twist is, okay? But she did give me one hint. Oh boy, I don't know if I want to know this. She said it was something that we've been joking about. We've been joking about everything. Right? That, I could never put that together. So, when I saw, and we also made a joke about it when we looked at his body, that there is a knife going through his hand. Uh-huh. I'm saying right now, and I don't think this is the case, but I just want to put it out there in case it is the case. Okay. That his right hand actually does have a mind of its own. That would be- And he was fighting it, and it was stabbing himself in the legs, and then his other hand was like fighting his right hand and then stabbed it into the ground. That is the craziest fucking shit I've really ever Really stupid. Heard in my life. But I'm just putting it out there. I'll I'm gonna quote the, the somebody in the comments and on Reddit here. I'm gonna say, I love hearing Dung and Ramka theories. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all I'll yeah. say. <laughs> Although there was something in the other hand because it didn't have blood on it. Right. Um, but that that's even too crazy for me. Okay. But maybe not too crazy for Danganronpa. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Go. All right. If we can really go home after we deal with this class trial, I'll definitely find out who the killer is, no matter what, even if I have to pull out all the stops. The dude I thought died 16 deaths ago, <laughs> I just found out wasn't even in this fucking game. <sighs> what the fuck? Why are you guys here? Or why are you here? Sorry. You haven't realized it yet? The feeling of wanting to leave the silent, thinking like that is Monokuma's trap, you know? Huh? Huh? What are you saying? Got it? There's no way Monokuma will end things here. He's planning something far worse. Ah, uh, stop trying to jinx us. I'll pick you up. Damn right, stupid rabbits, you just shut up. <laughs> Tricks are for fucking kids. <laughs> Everyone, you mustn't run away from despair. Oh my god. She is saying Monokuma's playing tricks. So she is a silly rabbit that's saying the tricks are for kids. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> huh? I just had like a beautiful mind moment. <laughs> uh, 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 Equations. <laughs> I have finally realized, after losing my powers, after seven days, I've realized that cursing your powerlessness or your fate accomplishes nothing. The possibility may be small, but as long as there's a possibility, you must face it in order to become someone who can be proud of yourself. So I will fight! <laughs> What's her deal? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> um, I do not really know, but she seems different than before. She seems cool. Maybe she read a self-help book, but... <laughs> but her eyes, she looks so determined. <laughs> what can you tell just by looking at those button eyes? Uh, anyway, make sure you turn off Minimaru. It would be annoying if you started talking during the trial. Huh. Eh, fine. Somehow, I understand what Monomi is saying. I think? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's get going to the glass class trial. You're right. We need to fight as much as we can. We need to poop and fight and fight some more. And if it was a, a <laughs> large class where we studied glass cutting, it would be the last mass glass trial. <laughs> no, the last mass glass class trial. <laughs> Holy shit. I confused myself with that. No matter what hopeless truth awaits us in the end. That's the end of that statement. Yeah, but... Roar. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love Boy. that last bit. This is like, ah, oh, we're done. Yeah, that is like a... It, it reminds me of those things we're always talking about, those uh, learn how to draw books. Oh, yeah. It's like, one circle, two circles, three circles, rhinoceros. <laughs> <laughs> this is the end. Fully formed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, draw a circle, then draw the rest of the fucking owl. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> I kept saying those words to myself over and over within my mind. I entered Monokuma Rock. <laughs> it always seems like it's going Bye. a little too hard. Yeah, again. yeah. Wow. Oh, man. The triangle of survival. This elevator ride, this will be the last time for this too, right? We Get sure have had some good times. <laughs> yeah. I hope so. 
Let's worry about things after we're finished. You are right. More importantly, we must focus on the class trial before us. It's true. Sure it's taking a long time now Sorry, that there's I lots just, of us. Just get a little barfy. The killer managed to kill someone like Nagito. There's no way this is going to go smoothly. I mean, I still can't believe one of us was able to do that. Um. Nagito was problematic in many ways, but he was also a valuable asset during the trial. Yeah, you're right. I guess. <laughs> in fact, during the Funhouse ordeal, we were completely dependent on him. But even if he's gone, the ones who have survived need to stand and fight. We must fight. He was problematic. He made me say things like oof, and yikes, <laughs> and big mood. <laughs> And then, the door slowly <laughs> opened. This br bright light green. Is that the light of hope? Or the light of spirit? The case will never know. <laughs> well, now. Oh, well then, now that the chatterbox Nagito is gone, there are only six of you left. Enough! Just fucking start this already! Hey, uh, okay. <laughs> oh, 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 take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, this is it, right? This is really the last class trial, right? Yep. Yep, it sure is. <laughs> so you gotta show some enthusiasm and make sure you give it your all. all right. Didn't I tell you? He said it. This is the end. Uh -huh. now, then. now then, let's get this trial started. <laughs> this is the last class trial. Let's show some enthusiasm and kill each other. Oh, let's do it. This is the fifth class trial. According to Monokuma, this is also the last class trial. That curtain is about to rise. <laughs> Remember this? Hi! <laughs> Nagito Koma Ada, the ultimate lucky student. Give me a Y! <laughs> <laughs> when I first met him, I thought he was gonna suck my dick. I thought he was a nice guy. <laughs> he came across as very sociable. And then that. <laughs> oh man, yeah. <laughs> but his true nature held such a demented thought process that was nothing like his outward appearance. I wish I'd known he was like that. Before he sucked my dick. <laughs> By then it was too late. <laughs> it, the, the way that his like mouth is kind of dragging behind his nose, it kind of looks like it's just like stretching out. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he said he believed in hope more than anything else. <laughs> now he's fucking dead. What an <laughs> idiot. He said he was yearning for powerful Fat hope. Fat load of good that did him. <laughs> <laughs> could overcome any despair. He said he would even help to he would even help despair just to prove that hope will never lose to despair. How's that working out for you? <laughs> <laughs> he said he'd become a stepping stone for hope. His way of thinking was completely screwed up. He got stabbed a bunch, but there were also times he saved us too. <laughs> like then. <laughs> Someone like him was killed. That was the end of him. Anyway. Looking hopeful. I, mean, I have no D.I.D. at all who did it, but I'm not, I'm not really upset about it. There's no way we can end this without knowing! We will be consumed by despair! Now that I look at Teru Teru, like, what was up with his face? <laughs> <laughs> That's why. We absolutely have to find out. The person who finished off Nagito. The killer who murdered Nagito. Just what the heck is going on here? <laughs> In order to return from this despair alive, we need to reach the truth. And if Monokuma says this is really the last class trial, it's all the more reason we need to do this. Filler, filler, filler. <laughs> this life-threatening trial billowing with hope and despair, the last one, has begun! The tension in the room, you can cut with a knife! I saved it in an empty, empty slot! I set my skills! <laughs> trial. All rise, baby. Let's begin with a simple We know how trial. this goes. Mm -hmm. During the class trial, you will present your arguments for who the killer is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. You oh. ascended the ladder of adulthood oh. and reached the moon because you're a rabbit? Oh, I get that because the rabbit in the moon. Right. In Japan. Yeah, yeah. Chesto! Chesto indeed, Monokuma. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> it's what it's like a thing. Okay. It's like you'd see it in like Japanese fighting games where they're like, Chesto! Oh, well, I love it when that, when you oh say it like that. Yeah. Jeez, how about this one? She's gonna get tied up again. Da 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 da. <laughs> Good nyanya. <laughs> Damn, Nomi. Stay on your ground. Swelling up fast. Please stop. I feel bad for Monomi. You're right. 
<laughs> Is that how it's pronounced? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> started after all. The victim this time is Nagito, who was attempting to reveal the traitor for everyone's sake. Yeah, because he was such a cool guy. World killed him. I'm so curious. I mean, I know, but if he was killed for trying to reveal the traitor. That traitor is obviously the killer. They were trying to shut Nagito up. Well, that's that's a really long reach, but okay. No, that might not be it. Huh? Are you trying to protect the traitor? They didn't call out when we were in danger. Wait. Don't tell me you're the traitor. I'll fucking kill you. Say something so stupid. There's no way in hell I'm the traitor. I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> now that's more like it. Why don't you guys hurry and start arguing already? We already are. Yeah. Way ahead of you. The traitor and the killer who murdered Nagito is here, right? Or maybe they're not. <laughs> are they the same person? Or are they different people? Fuck. Why, why is Gundam's X like a Roman numeral X? Uh, it's just because it's like fancy, I don't know. There's some, some of them have like unique X's. No, I know that, but usually it has something to do with who they were. Killer didn't take Nagito's mouth to shut him up. Oh. Uh, oh, oh god, we're trialing. Yeah, I know. Which means? The reason Nagito's body was covered with wounds. It's because the killer tortured Nagito. Okay. So that's why Whoops. he was so beat up. <laughs> and we're off to a great just, start. Just relearning the yeah, controls. Yeah, yeah, just, just, it's all coming back. Definitely the bomb's hiding place. Uh, the bomb's hiding place. But we already knew where it was, right? Whoever found the bomb first. Torture wounds. Whoops. I'm just fucking. Oh, around. okay, yeah. Uh, do, you know what? Next, next time, time on Game Grubs, we'll we'll get our bears. Yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> yeah it's, it's, that fine. one doesn't count. Yeah, don't worry about uh, it. <laughs> don't don't comment on that one. <laughs> 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 All right. Goodbye. Bye. Oh man.